you know, as much as I'm not really a fan of April Fools, I can't believe the year where April 1st lined up with a stream day, Sega just decided, oh yeah, we'll release like an actually good visual novel for Sonic the Hedgehog. So, so it's like, oh well, there, there goes my plans. <laughs> I, I had a stupid idea, but then they were like, no, do our idea instead. And I was like, okay, sure. I guess I will, and I guess I'll enjoy myself. And now, a year later, they didn't do that. So now I guess it's just business as usual, because it's April 2nd, so it's not like it's gonna really matter if I uh, do an April Fool's thing. I don't know. But now there's no, there's no follow-up to Murder the Sonic the Hedgehog either. Well, I, I guess that's just where we are. And where we are in Code Vein is going to the depths. So, uh, I've currently got two more regular depths maps to do. Actually, one and a half, really. Uh, and then it's the it's DLC time, which I think I'm ready for. I was just barely getting my ass kicked too much to really make the first one feasible. So... I think I'm ready and able to do the next ones, or at least I will be soon enough. Now, I want to say I did uh, give myself a new blood code and a whole bunch of stuff, right? Well, we'll see. Here we are, Code Vein. Alright, so, offline, continue. Now, if I remember correctly, I should just have plenty of dots on the map, right? Oh, that's Banana Eating Ogre, obviously. D did you not see I'll him clutching, uh, the banana that he pretended to get stabbed with? <laughs> Recently, I learned the, the, da the release date of that one, and it just occurred to me today that I have indeed missed, uh, the air date of Banana Eating Ogre, so... Alas, I... I cannot, uh, I, I can't use that in time. Guess I'm just gonna use that one in the accompanying images, just random points throughout the year. Okay, so, yes, we are in the middle of building Please this stuff. Do you might regret. I don't even know why I would say that. <laughs> what, what's the context, Eo? Alright, so, onward we go. Also in a similar vein to Sega interrupting me, that thought also interrupted the original thing I was going to come up uh, in with. It's now just me talking normally. Oh, hey, how's it going? Uh, but I was originally going to start with the fact that uh, I did complete uh, Saints Row today. I, I finished uh, recording that, the, the footage for it. And of course, you know what that means. That's right, I spent at least a decent part of my afternoon trying to figure out how to get Saints Row 2 to run. Something Not shit. <laughs> how to make Saints Row 2 PC, like, kind of functional. It's certainly a time. To be fair, most of it is just, uh, Gentleman of the Road to run. Which, you know, that, that's an easy enough download and patch. Now I just need to figure out how Saints Row 2 Power Tools works. Once I do that, I can actually, like, I think the, the issue is I need to cap the game off at 30 frames per second. Which is what it's supposed to run at, normally. Uh, but it doesn't, so that means the cutscenes are just sort of incorrect. People are just moving out of sync of where they're actually supposed to be. And it's very easy to tell that that's the case. Because they are way off course. It's kind of just another case of... This is running worse because my computer's too good. My Which, you know, I... That is a thing I've under- Oh! Scout Prestige! I think that's one of the ones I needed. Uh... I think so. But yeah, no, just... Look, I've understood the concept of... 
a computer running too well to run a thing well. Uh, cause that's been a thing for a while, but it's still just a buck wild concept, concept to me that that can happen in such a way. Like, damn, your specs are too good. What's that? Now this is gonna run like absolute crap. It's like, damn, how did you manage that? But I mean, like, I, I don't know the exact beginning of such a phenomenon, but like, oh, that is two bosses. But like, I know tying like, the game speed to cycles is one of the earliest examples of that. I just you made it so that like, it's, it's all just tied to computer speed, which is all well and good, you know, uh, on regular computers that we have now. Uh, when computers get better in the future, however, this shit's gonna run way too fast to even be possible to keep track of. Now that I think about it, that must have actually been how, um... PC version of Sonic 3 ran to some extent, because, like... If you tried to run that in windowed mode, uh, it was literally too fast to play. Like, you would press right, and then you would probably die for running into a thing. You would just careen yourself into that first bad nick and die horribly. Uh, though that's not the case if it ran on full screen, which I was delighted to learn when I was younger. Somehow I managed to get it to full screen, which was a terrifying concept to me, um, back in the day. Like, a thing enveloping the entirety of the screen? That, that seems bad. I don't like that. Don't like that at all. But no, that, that's how you made it run well. Even if you can't see the rest of the, the desktop, it's fine. It's still possible to, to exit to desktop. It's all right, young me. You're not trapped in this game forever. But yeah, to a certain extent, I guess that must have been kind of how that worked. I, I don't know if that's exactly the case. Because it's also wild that running it in full screen would then fix it. But I guess full screen must have had a cap of some sort. This place is that, uh, that window did not. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh no, I'm stuck. Uh, how the fuck did I get here? Yes, I, yeah, I did. <laughs> it is, um, certainly a version, and man, I wish it weren't certainly a version. I mean, technically, uh, the PC port of, uh, Sonic Ride. Oh, modded? Cool. Technically, that version, you know, is called the Dolphin Emulation, but <clears throat> anyway. Oh, man. Modded Sonic Riders does sound good, though. If that fixes shit, that'd be great. I fucking love Sonic Riders, at least the original. I never did get Sonic uh, Zero Gravity. I didn't have a Wii when it came out, but I didn't think it looked as good anyway. Did not think that the Zero Gravity gimmick was, like, as interesting as just the the original base game. Never did fully complete that game because mission mode was pretty tough. I don't want to play Sonic Riders again. <laughs> I guess I could always uh, add that to a uh, list of uh, probably Thursday streams because I did technically complete Sonic Riders. Well, the main issue with that, instead of doing an LP, of course, is that uh, some of those end game races were really fucking hard. Like, the second story version of Babylon Garden was a nightmare. <laughs> and, like, regular Babylon Garden was really difficult, too. Like, that one took me a while to beat. I forget what the secondary version was called at this point, but I would I would recognize it if I saw it. I would I would point at it and screech <laughs> if I were to see it again. The fuck did I get here? Oh right, PC ports. Wow, that was a long tangent. <laughs> anyway, all that is to say, yeah, Saints Row 2 is gonna be a different thing. Oh, <laughs> you forward soldier. I'm not the euphoric soldier. 
I'm just one soldier that's normal. Alright, well, that's kind of an interesting gimmick. Uh, it's just a whole lot of enemies. I say kind of, because, you know, the Souls games have done stuff like that before. Oh! A bunch of them didn't even aggro, jeez. Uh, but yeah. You know, the Souls games uh, do stuff like this. Probably to greater effect, though, because that was just a couple of extra enemies. <laughs> and one regular-ish soldier. One slightly better but otherwise normal soldier. Saints Row, uh, Saints Row's 1 and 2 have been interesting times in terms of just getting them going. 1 wasn't so bad. Oh yeah, Sonic Freeriders, I... I... <laughs> Sonic Freeriders, I think, more exists to, like, demo the new voice actors. Because that was, like, the first game where they had a new set of voice actors, which I think that was... Was that the, for the Roger Craig Smith, like... That general generation of them, I think it was. I can relax both my mind and body here. Actually, how am I doing on stuff? What am I even currently using? Skip prestige one. Okay, so it must have been the uh, rest of the voice actors. Cause I believe that was that uh, general time. General time period. The Sonic Colors, though, did not have, like, the full voice cast, though. Because Sonic Colors really pared down the cast overall. That was just Sonic Tails, Eggman, Orbot, Cubot, and that's it. Oh, wow, I'm so close to being done with most of these. Ugh. Alright, Heimdall's what I'm using right now. Only one level. These are pricey anymore. Alright, do I have all the keys? I do indeed. Yeah, as I was gonna say about Saints Row 1, Saints Row 1, uh, through Xenia, you know, obviously has its share of- This bitch again? Really? How many times do I have to teach you this lesson, old man? Uh, yeah, obviously, some graphical issues, again, because the computer's just too good, so... For whatever reason, that just makes everything kind of flicker a little bit after the edges. Oh god, just that was an instant KO. Get away from her! But uh, the other problem though is uh, all the audio is like slightly off. Just like by half a second. So, every time I put together those videos, I do have to, uh, shift the audio back a bit, so it actually lines up. I don't think it's been noticeable because I think I've consistently fixed it without it you know, still being an issue. I have not missed it at any point. Unlike me there, I'm missing constantly because this dude's just teleporting. Hey, do you have a cooldown for any of your stuff? Noticing not done any damage in a while as you keep doing this shit. <laughs> there we go. Get dead, idiot. 
Oh, I got some tungsten, mastered a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, good, the, uh, better stamina. Cool. I'm gonna say then that I would like to increase my, uh, haze again. Still gotta work on charge accelerator, though. And this one is called Heimdall. Okay. So let's see. Uh, do I need anything else on Heimdall? Easiest way to check is to just go through... Uh, there's... There's Heimdall. Oh god, I've got two more things to learn. Jesus Christ. So Severing Abyss, Regenerate... Regeneration Shift. I don't know why I messed up saying that one. So that's passive, that's active. Never mind, I guess I won't get more haze. Oh, there it is. I see it. Should be over here, right? Alright, so that's probably like a, uh, one-handed weapon, one-handed sword, uh, ability. Alright, well, uh, that's it for this area. As I thought, that was fairly quick. Alright, so we're gonna have to fight him in the next map, too. <laughs> I feel like he's just gonna keep showing up forever. When it is time to go to Silva, I would ask that you take me with you. Eo, I take you I everywhere. I simply wish to be present. There is a message that I must deliver. If it is not a problem, then please... It would be more of a problem to have to take anyone else <laughs> at this point. Alright, Restore Vestige. Do I have enough for scouts? Oh, no, apparently I... When the fuck did I get Achilles? Who the fuck is Achilles and why? What? Okay, so I need Scout Vestige Part A and C. I must have picked this up from the boss? When did I get this? <laughs> I'll need more scout vestiges. So I'll get those, you know, when I get them, but... the fuck did I pick up Achilles? <laughs> Alright, well, um... Let's see, code owner unknown. Just some lady. That's for dynamic combat with high dexterity and stamina. Oh, cool. Let's see, invigorating rush. Oh, cool, that's also good. But it is active, so I don't know how much I'd really use that. That's everything from that tree learn. Alright, cool and good. I guess I'll learn that one later. Is there anything here? Alright, yep, that looks good, and I cannot level up. Okay, oh, and you know, I did want to go visit uh, Eo and give her something real quick. What is it? Let's see. What do I want to give? Protein powder? You into that? Bottle jam, antique LP record. Wait, were the video games the thing you didn't like, or was it that like stuffed animals or something? I do not know what this is, but I will accept it. What the fuck is Monster Hunter? You are going now? Take care. I think she didn't like stuffed animals. Because they remind her too much of her own plight. Don't forget to check your gear before fighting. 
Alright, let's also give you something. Uh, you seem like you would love custom gun parts. Huh? Are you really sure? Yes! I've been wanting this for a long time! Alright, uh, do I have do anything I need to upgrade? Let's see. That's plus ten. This is plus ten. I could make this plus ten. I've got the tungsten for it. You know what? Why the hell not? Just make myself a cool ice sword. <laughs> you know what? I'm worth it. Argent Wolf Brand. That's pretty cool. That's plus ten. Yeah, all the weapons I really want to use are kind of already plus ten. I mean, Impulse Anchor isn't, but guess what? Now it is. Which blood veil do you want to upgrade? That's ten. All right, when I go to an ice area, it is gonna be over for certain hoes. Probably should have done Night Thorn Fire, huh? That might have been a better idea. Upgrade the thing that has fire resistance for the fire area. Oh wait, this isn't where I need to go. Before I can teleport right... Actually, no. Real quick, I would like to... Check... Oh, I can't. Honestly, I want to jump... This is all we've got for available routes. Alright, so let's see. 100%. I did get 100% here. Not listing any of the, uh, blood code stuff as rewards, so. I do not have a checklist on here. Alright, well, uh, Void Don't District is the last area we I'm have to go to before we reach state. the DLC. Alright, so let's see. Void District. This looks a lot like the area we were just in. There must be a purpose for We this. only need two keys, though. Which means this is gonna be so much easier. Actually, while we're at it, um... Let's be off, then. This? Okay, then that's the only ability I can use. Let's play with this for a bit, I, th I guess. Lost Nothing's gonna be as strong as the Vihander, but... I think that's an okay damage! Kinda hard to tell, I immediately got smacked. breakable. See, now that I'm breaking everything, or trying to, nothing's breakable. Because I'm like, okay, there was one time where there was a key hidden in breakable stuff because I wasn't breaking enough. Okay, need to get closer. But... Okay, so you also do a cool flip away, so if you don't get smacked by a hammer in the middle of the move, then it's also a dodge as well, which is useful. You have to time it, but I, I can see how that'd be good. Less range on that AoE than I would have expected, though. It's really just a very small pool. We haven't been noticed. It has that's a lot of guys. Can't believe we found ourselves in just the the hyena pit from Lion King. <laughs> Damn it! They're prepared for us. I can tell because they sang a whole song about it.
wasn't really the hyena's song, though, so I don't know if I'm that threatened. I see something there. I don't know, that line kind of uh, stole the show on that one. Okay, I got some tungsten, but here's the parade. Probably isn't the weapon I want to use. Very much not the weapon I want to use. Kia was left to her own devices and could not kill them. Alright, well, as uh, my hand it is. You're finally awake again. Oh, you weren't dead for that long. You had 662 more damage. That is a ridiculously higher attack power. I mean, look, I know it's a giant slab of metal, but still. Did they spot us then? Well, that guy did. The one I wasn't paying attention to definitely got the jump on me. Probably on account of me not paying attention to him. to do the parade, but I'm gonna... I'm gonna do the parade. Damn it. Sorry, EO. Come on. There we go. Okay, well, that was a relatively easy parade, at least. But I don't have EO anymore. So, I mean, there's really no reason to stick around. I'm just gonna go back to the, <laughs> the last missile. This is a pretty quick and easy trip, though. Especially since a lot of these guys don't necessarily aggro on you. Oh, this one might. You gonna Lost aggro on me? Nearby. No! Cool. I'll fight you on the way back, I promise. Ah, so I can trade them. To the hyena pit.
here, so there's probably boss over here. Yep, long hallway. Long hallway always means boss. The one problem is I have not found that first key, though. At least I don't think I have. And I do want that key. Oh, this is gonna look... Uh, this looks like it's gonna be vaguely annoying. <laughs> oh no, a blade bear! Who the fuck owns a sword in this day and age? Oh, right, yeah. Hey, I have your weapon. Oop, sorry, e oh, Eo's screwed now. Nope, nope, you stop doing that. Oh yeah, since you're ice, I should probably do that. So yeah, fire weapon's probably a better idea. Man, I can't run a while with this better stamina, though. Guess Jack's good for something. Okay. So you hadn't activated. I was curious and then I got too close. I hope this short nap does you some good. Me? I'm not napping. Or were you talking about the loss we fought? But so far, us killing them hasn't really improved them at all. They have the same disposition as before we killed them. Did you find something good? I forget what's this one again? Morale boost. Hmm, that might actually be pretty useful. I'll give it a try. Fight freely. I will provide support. I'll make good use of this. I actually don't like that move that much, honestly. I kinda don't really like being stuck in uh just whatever flip that is. Back flip. Normally I would like a good backflip, but it just feels like I'm getting stuck in an animation that I don't necessarily want to be. I don't know, maybe I can cancel out of it? Uh... Oh, I can actually. Ow, my fa <laughs> The entirety of my face. Get away from her. You don't get to punish her for my mistakes. Now that she's healed, you can target her. It's 
There we go. Oh, okay, so yeah, you do get the key from the boss. Got it. Alright, so that's the first Void District key. Easy enough. Wait, you know what? Um, do I care that much about that one enemy I missed? No, I don't. Why should I have to walk back if I could just use this? Oops. I'll just use the dang thing. <laughs> How close am I with these? Ugh. Still feels like I'm very far away. Oh well. We've escaped those confined quarters. I really didn't like that hallway. Don't ask me why, I just didn't. Are you kidding me? A second parade? Why are there two parades? That's illegal! The district will hear about this! You can't just have two parades. Not the end. Do not be afraid. Let's try this again. This time, I'm gonna ask that I get to see her license. Really? Boo. What is your attack taking precedence over mine? My spin was cooler, therefore, that means it should have happened. into, idiot. Alright, well, I'll probably have to heal after that one. <laughs> probably gonna have to return to... Oh, nice. Queen Titanium. And I'm probably gonna have to return to the missile, because if one side had a relatively tough boss, I'm guessing the other will, too. <laughs> Oh boy, another dagger. Oh. <laughs> hey, I could tell you are alive. You are vibrating. Get out of here with that. Here. <laughs> okay, now how did that happen? And why aren't you doing anything to help? You guys seem like terrible friends. I guess they could be enemies. Thank God he 
finally killed Phil. I was real tired of that guy. Over here. Inside. Black bayonet slow. If I went, was one for bayonets, that would probably be pretty good. And more custom gun parts. You know, every once in a while in this game, I think, what if they just add mimics out of nowhere? What if suddenly I open one of these and it does just eat me? <laughs> Because look, this game has done plenty of things, uh, you know, that aren't a regular Souls thing. But I mean, mimics exist outside of Souls. It's, it's not a Souls exclusive thing. Is that? Yeah. I've got three heals left. Let's just go back to start real quick. <laughs> that looks like trouble. And I'll just keep going though. Alright, so I need to go over here. I'm not reactivating the parade. Absolutely not. Lost nearby. <laughs> Okay, charge accelerator. Just need a couple more things and then I can leave Jack's class behind. Whoop. <laughs> He's coming out of nowhere to be a jerk. Turn it around immediately. Just had to chomp me one time just to show that he could. Alright, well. Here's the other half of this team. Cannon here. Oh dear. <laughs> They're synchronized. Quit doing that. There. <laughs> and actually, I probably actually want to use the Vi-Hander. If I'm correct, the these are supposed to be, like, whatever elemental system Mega Man Zero works off of. Technically, if you're a fire guy, I should be using electricity. Okay, well, lesson learned. Don't be in proximity when he does that. Actually... Hey, Eo, can I get, like, three seconds? Thanks. Ah, you jerk. that far, I'm like, I should move. But that procced very quickly, so... Just the thought was not enough to get me out of harm's way. Nonetheless, get out of here, Cannoneer. I definitely would have lost if... Uh... I had come on in here with, what was that, two, three heals. That. Yeah, that would not have gone over well for me. Alright, now I get the feeling... 
that the boss is going to be the two of them combined. We're going to have to fight them as a team again. And what do you know, I'm on a new class as well. Oh, it's for dynamic combat with high dex dexterity and stamina. I mean, what is going to be good for this? Should actually be looking through here. So let's see. Obviously, I have nothing from Achilles. Achilles has four things. Um, all of which are active, which means I could have whatever passives I wanted, which would definitely help. This, however, is... Hmm. Gotta be one-handed sword, though. Otherwise, I can only use that one move if I'm using a polearm or bayonet, which I usually don't. Just use that. I'm doll is done. Festus is done. Warrior's done. Ishtar's done. Harmonia's done. I should save this for the Ice DLC. Dark Knight I need to work on. High Endurance and Strength. It's mostly Halberd based though, that's the main problem. Don't really have anything great Halberd wise. Uh, Survivor I haven't used yet. Dexterity, boss gifts that are useful in battle. Artemis is bayonet based, so not particularly useful. Isis is done. That's done. Should really just have like a list written out so I could cross stuff out. But I'm not writing that right now. I actually do have a lot of these completed, though. Yeah, because neither of those can be learned. I've got this weird sort of sandwich of completed stuff down here and up there, but in the middle, don't have a lot of it. Um... Hmm... be a good sword for both of them. Hmm. I think Achilles is the way to go. Because I can just ignore these while using them, honestly. Yeah, let's try out Achilles. Oh, except that does cut out... Wait, what? That cuts out all my good weapons. Fuck off. <laughs> Is this not a one-handed blade? Is this different from just a one-handed blade? <laughs> or katana's just slightly different? Because broadsword works. Alright, well, never mind then. Alright, yeah, let's give this a shot. I can at least use this stuff even though it's not ideal. Let's see, Dark Knight, what does it have? It has... Active, 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 active. One passive. The rest active. That is, once again, pretty good. It means I can go HP, Stamina, Pioneer's Guidance, and... Oh god, what's the passive on this one again? Albert Mastery. Well, I guess I could equip the... Albert Ice. Because maybe it'll be helpful, but I feel like it won't be. Yeah, let's put that there. Yeah, 
blood weapons there. Flame protection might actually be useful. If part of the boss is cannoneer, then that would be a helpful thing. Yeah, I know. I'm well aware, don't you worry. Let's see. Pretty sure Tormenting Blast is the one I like. And, uh, can I find the one I was just using, the, uh, stamina increase? Because that was useful. Oh. Oh, I don't have the fortitude for it. Ugh. Sure, whatever. Let's just go with that. Alright, I'm positive. Oop. I'm positive I don't have all my HP anymore. Uh, oh, and I might as well level up if I can. I can level up twice. Cool, good. Alright, am I correct in assuming this is... Ornstein Smo again. Yep, I'm seeing you, and... There's Cannoneer. Okay, yeah, no. I'm seeing Dangerous Lost around. Oh, this one's gonna be tough. Okay, yeah, this one's not gonna be fucking around at all. And I guess electric is a decent neutral element against them. Actually, technically I should be resistant to this, maybe? I don't know. I really don't know how this is work in this game. Second thought, never mind. I don't apologize. Good morning. Alright, so yeah, definitely not to be trifled with. As I kinda figured. Though admittedly, it would be kinda nice if we just went in and they were made of tissue paper. Oh, oh, ah, fuck. Oh dear. Get out of there. Damn it, he's protecting his partner while she's down. How dare he? Oh cool. You just positioned yourself for me perfectly. Oh no! Oh, they're Ornstein and smelling! They saved it for the fucking DL- well, not DLC map. Oh my fucking god, they actually did the thing. <laughs> they did the fucking thing! And now he's fully healed to the fort. Now it's Cannoneer Ice version. 
Well, clearly I'm gonna need to kill Cannoneer first, then. Fuck, fuck, shit, fuck. <laughs> oh god. Just got missile barraged out of nowhere. I'm doing my best, no guarantees. I die. So... Okay, good. Yeah, clearly I have to kill Cannoneer first so that uh, Blade Bearer gets fire powers and then I get her armor set instead. Even though that's not how this works and I already have her weapon, which is really all I needed from that transaction. Nonetheless. Do you have everything you'll need? I don't know if I do, TBH. Fucking believe they aren't seen this much. Oh, you, you ass. Ah, damn it. Sorry, EO. Oh, well, I'm extremely boned. Yeah, you know, just kill me. That's not going anywhere. Okay, I'm gonna not pick up the haze because that's just gonna be a distraction. I'm just going to accept that that haze is gone forever. I, never give up. I mean, you might think you see it right there, on the map, and now in the overworld, but you don't. It's not there. Kill your partner first so you can get empowered. Shouldn't you want that to become stronger? What's Cannoneer ever done for you? Probably nothing, so he should die. Thinking about it, I do hope there isn't some sort of exclusive equipment depending on how you beat them. Because I would prefer her stuff overall, but it just dawned on me that it's actually probably way easier to survive this fight if I go for her first. If I go for Blade Bearer. I have an armor that will resist. Oh, fuck off. Because I need better mind. Why do I need better mind to wear a parka, you ass? Ugh. I can use that. I think I want to use Assassin's Sickle overall. Is there anything that increases mind? If I equip that, can I put on a parka? Thank you. <laughs> this is my ass kinking outfit, bitch. Alright, so I have a weapon that is more neutral uh, to their respective types. Let us that way neither this. of them resist anything. And now that I have a parka, she should do less damage to me. The biggest problem, though, is I have lost access to my good, uh, ability. Come on, don't tell me the disparity in this one's even great. Well, I guess I must have lost some defensive power for having an element equipped to this. 
That didn't do anywhere near as much damage. Ah, yeah, see, fire does a ton of damage, though. I did not want to trade dance partners, that's quite alright. Oh, this counts as a halberd? Cool. And you're poisoned. Okay, back off. Damn it. Sorry, EO. Die immediately. That does not go as far as I thought it would. Missed with your close-range AoE, which is kind of impressive in a way. Mostly it's just... Oh, well, that fucked me up. Royally. Alright, that's definitely the better idea, though. That is definitely a good idea to go with. Harka will be good at resisting damages. Uh, let's just get rid of you for... Oh god, where's Poison Shot again? Right, it's here. Or, uh... Yeah, Venom is Shot. Ah, uh, makes sense, it's an attack name. Uh, anyway, though, yeah, okay. I got this. I just need Cannoneer oh, to do gosh. less, overall. Is that not a piece of venom? Why? I can hit her with it on the weapon, then why not? Oh wait, I used wrong move, didn't I? Must have done... Whatever the current... God, that is persistent. There we go, yeah, okay, I used the wrong one. That's on me. Oh, really? I mean, I guess it's fair if their stuff takes priority over mine, but I mean, come on. Can't I be cool sometimes? She just died. There's more we can learn. Think back on our experiences. Hmm. I'm thinking back on... Okay, so if I were to use the fire... One... Okay, so I was thinking the disparity wouldn't be so bad between these two uh, pieces of armor, but holy shit. Now granted, doesn't have ice protection, but, hmm, I, I don't know, like, I'm definitely taking a lot less damage from ice, but, hmm, hmm. Let's see, what could I do? I could... I think part of the problem is... 
Not having uh, the spin move is definitely a bit of a problem. Yeah, like this is, yeah, sword and hammer. Can I equip hammers? I can. So I could always use impulse anchor. No matter what I'm gonna... Actually, I don't have to. Uh, let's... Take Tormenting Blast. And then we'll put the other thing down here. That way I can still learn this. And technically I can still use it. I just have to switch weapons. Alright, so... We'll seek out. Find our victory. Still take less. Oh, damn it. See, this is why I don't want to. Go for it. You're not gonna... Okay, sure, whatever. That's why I don't want to go for Cannoneer first. She sure is a right? lot more aggro. Alright, yeah, I think I'm gonna keep the Winter Ice Mantle. And I'm gonna try to do a little more weapon switching, but you are just too aggro, and quite frankly, uh... I don't want to learn this like I learned the Ornstein Smo fight, so... Please stay in your lane. Yeah, it seems you've switched to fighting me instead of EO. might not even bring me back. Oh, the good part about having a partner is that they'll distract the other boss, kind of. The bad news is, she'll also get distracted by the boss. Heading there now.
Okay, well that didn't work out. Communal gift is not that helpful. As long as you're still standing, I shall never give up. Oh yeah, that's all that does. Okay. We will seek out and find our victory. <laughs> That's not doing that much damage. Ice resistance is handy for that. Damn. Lack of fire resistance, however, kind of fucking sucks for this guy. Because he is just doing shit. He doesn't care what my opinion on the matter is. Very rude like that. Good move to use then. not be stunlocked anymore, that would be great, but no, I just kept getting back into a fucking corner, and yeah, didn't bother doing anything. Thank you, EO. Shouldn't be sarcastic to her, this isn't something that only she would fuck up. Everybody would fuck up bringing me back to life. Okay. But it's just too close. Good morning. Because they stuck together. Which means their defense was impenetrable. Calm your emotions. <laughs> Really went forward into it. I think the better idea to overall is to just swallow a bunch of uh, condensed whatever and upgrade my fire equipment. Yes. Because this guy is a real pain. I don't like having to deal with him at all. I know this is what I did the first phase, but. Now I'm not really having such a good time with going for Blade Bearer first. Is this fight a shmup because I'm getting actively worse at it? Defeat is not the end. Do not be afraid. All right, Night Thorn. All right, then we go back to home base. Uh. Hopefully I'll have enough to just only need to use condensed whatever to upgrade this, and I don't, don't need to buy Queen Titanium. Which blood veil do you want to upgrade? Let's see. 
five. Okay, so thirteen twenty. I'll just get two thousand. Make sure you get back. Well, it's got twenty minutes left, so chances are I'm probably not going to beat this fight today. Oh wow. Do you want to upgrade? Make sure you get back safe. Alright. Uh, you know what? I'll swallow like two of these, I think. Don't forget. What do you want to upgrade? Oops. Which blood, blood veil, veil do you want to upgrade? I need five titanium. Make sure All you right. get back How much for the titanium? Stock if you want it, I got it. Okay, so need four more, so eight thousand. Go out there and give it to him. Stock up. If you want Stock it. Stock up indeed. I got it. All right. Go out there and give it to him. Don't forget. Let's see. Great equipment. Blood Which veil. Blood do you want to upgrade? All right. Now I need. Make sure you get back. It's like a thousand. Do you want to upgrade? Alright, and what's the tungsten upgrade? I need, um... A little more than a thousand. Okay. Make sure you That's get fine. It's all relatively cheap. Honestly, it's... Not a problem to get the amount of haze she's asking for for the individual upgrades. That's the easy part. Which blood veil do you want to upgrade? It's usually the resources that wind up being pricey. I mean, I'll do my best. That was the entire point of this endeavor was to get back safe. All right, back to it. Okay, I'm going for Cannoneer this time. Because, honestly, fuck this guy. I hate all of your working organs, TBH. Oh god, that does so much less damage. Which weapon? Thank you. That still does a ton of damage, and now she wants to switch dance partners, which I did not ask for. Do not appreciate. Specifically to be element neutral, but if I'm fighting the fire guy anyway, oh, God damn it, sorry EO. I kinda just screwed you over. Yeah, if I'm being damage neutral, that's one thing. But I'm going after the fire guy, I should really have electric. Ah, my face. God damn it. Even when you have a 
partner, whoever is not fighting you, deciding they want to fight you, is still the worst thing. Yeah, now I'm not being careful at all. Definitely having more trouble with the fire element to this fight, though. That or the armor is just better in general, I don't know. Here we go. Good time to fall. Even if I take less damage from this stuff, it's still painful to do, so I prefer to not, you know, have stuff like that happen to me. Oh wow, holy shit. Whatever you did, do that again. Holy shit, nice job, EO. Fucking got that. Oh, we've been all over this map, huh? All right, there we go. We have recovered something. Still valuable. did not. Wow. Okay. Got nowhere near learning all that stuff. All right, give me halberd mastery. Let's just put that on. Well, definitely a good idea to have that fire armor upgraded, considering uh, we're done with this now. We're done with the DLC map. Or the, the regular Depths maps, rather. Now it's time to go back over here. Fiery Oblivion. Okay, so. Nothing is more important than preparedness. Let's have the Zweihander. And let's also... Oh, I can't level up, huh? Hmm. Should I just, like, eat all of my haze? And just level up as much as possible and then just do, like, miscellaneous upgrades? I don't know. Because I don't have any gifts to get. So unless I've once again mysteriously obtained a blood coat I don't know about, I feel like that's a good idea to just eat all of this haze I've been storing in my pocket, because it's not like it's going to be useful for anything anyway. What is it? Alright, did I just randomly get a thing? Nope, not this time. Should really look up the scout vestiges. You are going now? Take care. Alright, so... Let's just eat those for exactly one level. Hmm. 
yeah, you know what? I've got a, I've got a plan. In order to not fuck this up, let's go and teleport and I'm gonna kill a few guys. And then... I'll just level up. Because I'd like to not waste this, but... I don't think I'm gonna get all the haze I need. Up here, my Alright, so that guy went faster. That's good. Still don't want to fight them, though. <laughs> not, not interested. Okay, this definitely seems like it's gonna go smoother. Yeah, this is definitely going smoother. Sure. I have no idea what just happened, but it's good. Let's see, I think it was... 100,400 something, so... Let's just keep over here for the time being. I'm not gonna risk myself too much tonight. We have to choose one way or the other. Hey. You get over here. <laughs> get him, boys! I see you've not gotten her. Dawn. Okay, so everything here is definitely dying a lot faster. That is way better. And I think I have enough. I think I can go over here and level up and say I did not waste that haze I just ate. Yep, cool. 149, I'm almost halfway up the level. <laughs> the, the level tree. Halfway to the level cap, that's Something's how most people would say that. Alright, well, I don't think I'm gonna finish this leg of the area, but um... At least give it a, a, uh, a shot. So, Code Vein. It's just about done for today, which means I'm done with this for the rest of the week. But I'll be back next week. Oh, died immediately. Anyway, though, yeah. Uh, wow, that fucking sucked shit. <laughs> that was bad. Uh, anyway, though, yeah. Code Vein. Almost done for the week. But I'll be back next Tuesday, uh, 7 to 9 p.m. Eastern Time, where this time, it would seem, I will hopefully be beating the Hellfire Knight leg of the DLC. And once that is done, uh, we'll just move on to whatever is next on the list. Why can I not kill this man anymore? How was I so effective against this man the first time? This man should do a ton of fucking damage to him somehow. Anyway though, okay, so, now that that's done, other streams. Uh, Phoenix Wright is on Thursday. That one. 
is also 7 to 9 p.m. Eastern Time. We'll be wrapping up the investigation uh, for the final case. Which, of course, I mentioned this at the end of the other streams, but uh, that particular investigation also has one of my favorite scenes in the game, so excited for that. Oh, that was a very obvious attack. Oh, but yeah, that'll be a good time. And then Saturday, 9 to 11 p.m. Eastern Time is Persona 5 Royal. That was dumb. Uh, we will be figuring out uh, how to proceed through Madarame's Palace. And I want to make good progress, but at the same time, game did say, hey, there's going to be obstacles, so... As smooth as everything seems to be going. Stop focusing on that, man. Uh, at some point, we will be stopped. Oh, fuck. Uh, yeah, okay, so unfortunately, I can't be impatient. I still have to lure those guys out, even though I don't want to. Alright, well, I guess I'll just punch a couple of other guys in the meantime. Right, so, anyway. Uh, with that being said, uh, yeah, that's it for streams. That one, yeah, the Saturday 9 to 11 p.m. Eastern Time. And so, yeah, that, that, that's it for streams. But you can also catch the VODs on YouTube. I'm Fef 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 Fefner Masamone on there. Uh, and hey, guess what? In addition to streams, uh, there's also LPs. Uh, Mega Man X6 is on Monday. That's certainly a true thing you can say about Mega Man X6. It is happening. Do you want it to? Eh, maybe not necessarily, but it is. We've reached that point. X6 will happen regardless of whether or not Stay anyone cautious. wants it to. Be careful you don't and uh, anyway, yeah, uh, Saints Row is Wednesday. And Final Fantasy V is Friday. Ah, I can't blast it. I know, EO. Alright, uh, yeah, so, mention all the LPs. And hey, guess what? Uh, if you want to support me, you can do so through Patreon or Coffee. I'm Pfeffer on both those sites, and you can find links to use enough in the Twitch bio, or the YouTube banner, or underneath the YouTube videos. Alright, I've never actually made it through here. And I will continue not making it through here. Hey, buddy. Oh, and I'm dead. Yep, down I go. Ugh. Oh, actually, while I'm at it, though... There's more we can learn. Before I forget Think to do this next week, switch to this. Put on Halberd Mastery, because apparently this counts as a Halberd, and you know what? I'll take it. Anyway, though, yeah, that'll be it for this stream. I will see y'all next time, and hopefully I can make more progress here. Uh, I feel like the reason I just got my ass kicked is I'm not really taking this place seriously. Got a few levels, and now I've got a big head over it. Ugh. You know me, I'm so conceited. Oh, well. I'll fix that next time. Alright, yep, that'll be it. See y'all then. Have a good night.